Hello guys, welcome back to the video from the Innovators. In today's video, we are looking at a PIR sensor used to detect motion. It is a very useful sensor because it detects undesired motion, especially in the installation of security systems. Moreover, this sensor can be used in multiple ways. Like for example, you can program or install this sensor in a way that whenever you enter the room, the lights are turned on automatically. So this is how a PIR sensor looks like. It has two ports. One is for the sensitivity of the meter control or the distance and the other one is for the delay. The sensitivity of the PIR sensor is maximum to 7 meters and the delay is in a range of 0.3 to 0.5 minutes. If you try to open it, you can see an IR sensor in the middle. For the circuit building, we will be using the PIR sensor Arduino Nano, one LED, a breadboard and some jumper wires. Firstly place the LED and the Arduino Nano on the breadboard. Now before connecting the PIR sensor, let's see its pin configuration. It basically has three connections, which includes out, ground and VCC. Connect the VCC pin of the PIR sensor to the 5V pin of the Arduino Nano. Moreover, connect the ground pin of the PIR sensor to the ground pin of the Arduino Nano. Last but not the least, connect the out pin or the sensing pin of the PIR sensor to the A0 pin of the Arduino Nano. After that, connect the positive of the LED to the D12 pin of the Arduino Nano. Furthermore, connect the negative of the LED to the ground pin of the Arduino. Now we are done with the hardware. So let's move towards the software or the programming part. As you can see, our program is ready to be uploaded on the Arduino. You can find this code with the link in the description below. Before uploading, you need to check some uploading features. Like the board is set to Arduino board, the processor is 80 mega 328p and the port is COM8. After that, you are good to go. The hardware is done, the software is done and it's time to see the working of the circuit or the PIR sensor. As you can see, when we place our hand in front of the PIR sensor, the LED starts to glow. At this moment, the delay is set to low and the sensitivity is medium. Now let's see what happens if we increase the delay. As you can see, now the LED is taking some time to turn off. Let's further increase the delay and see what happens. Now the LED is taking some time to turn off. Literally some time. We can further improvise the system by adding a relay or a buzzer which responds in case of any intruder while installing the security system using the PIR motion sensor. So guys that's it for today. I hope you guys liked the video. If you did please hit the thumbs up and also subscribe the channel to watch our latest uploads as soon as possible. Also join us on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram. The links are in the description below. See you guys in the next video shortly. Bye bye. Stay safe. Peace out.